I'm good car! I want a neon RT! If This is Zach and no! Wyatt. No! What? Wah! 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 This is Zach and Wyatt, back at you with another video. So, who are you, and what is this? The mic's here. <laughs> we might have to redo that. <laughs> who are you, and what is this? My name's Ethan Williams, and... Oh, the mic! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Every person! <laughs> uh. My name's Ethan Williams, and this is my 2012 Mazda 2 Touring. Oh. Basking its glory. Yes! <laughs> Mazda 2! So, if you don't remember Ethan, first of all, he was in our Cardinals video. He yep. was the spokesperson yep. for the NASCAR feature thing. He yep. went real hard. He went really hard. He had I a cut about he had a, 20 minutes of it out. He had like a five page <laughs> essay on like the whole race of like the Indy 500 or something. I went college yeah. on their ass. Ethan, Ethan, he is back. So, tell us about your Mazda 2. So, this is my Mazda 2. I just got it about six months ago. I had to unfortunately sell my first car that I ever had because it just wasn't getting good gas mileage. I couldn't, uh, couldn't afford the seven miles to a gallon anymore. Yeah. That was so painful. That was a, that, what was it, a truck? Yeah, it was a 5.2 liter V8 Dodge Dakota. That was a cool truck. Yeah, I nicknamed it um, the SLTA <laughs> and threw like 1970 Challenger splitters on it and a spoiler. It was a fun truck, but... With two 75s all around yeah. with the, R, the R, Dakota RT wheels? Yeah. That was a cool truck. The thing gripped for days. I mean, it was just, you go in a corner, it was stupid. But now I have this, which does about 40 miles to the gallon. <laughs> yeah. um, has a whopping 100 horsepower from its 1.5 liter four cylinder. That's all you need. But the Don't best part, motor. yes, best part is it's a stick shift. Yes. So it's actually enjoyable. Oh, <laughs> shit, there it is. Without it, it would just be just pain and misery and I feel like I'm driving a chick car. <laughs> so. Can you open the hood this time? I will time? try to open the hood this time. This side. This, don't tell me where it is. No, because I don't want to watch you struggle. It's okay to bend down and look at it. Oh, he Ooh, got it. It's a steel hood, not that light. But and it, he got it, that. Well. So yes, here's where all the magic happens. Yes. All a hundred ponies are being contained in this monster ah, right you here. you said pony. That's where we used yeah. to work. <laughs> I threw that one in there. So yeah, it's pretty basic. I haven't touched the engine yet. I haven't. Don't know if I'm going to. If anything, I'll probably put a uh, cork sport. Um, what do you call it? Cold air intake on it because I think that would help it out a lot. This thing has all the peppers and billies and money. Everything and it ain't everything. It has all the ponies from the pony ride. <laughs> I ha I harnessed them. All of them. I harnessed them. No one's gonna understand these jokes. <laughs> oh well, who cares? Po Griffith Park Pony Rides. If you haven't heard of it, go check it out. That's where me and Ethan used to work. That's our first job. We go back ways. Yeah, we do. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it's a good little car. It, for it runs reliably. Um, it actually, on the drive up here, it was kind of surprising. Once you, if you find the right gear, it actually goes pretty good. It, so yeah, I was, I was following the whole also, way. If you go past three thousand, yeah, after I'm gonna shift into four. Yeah. Oh my God, what are you doing? Uh, I don't. I, <laughs> you guys know me. I don't beat my cars. To me, that, <laughs> I don't like revving things out. I don't like beating uh, the crap out of them. But it's it's because you're an American car guy. Japanese cars are made to rev. Out. Yeah, yeah they are. I know. If you over rev a V8, it's a problem. <laughs> actually, this is a this is Mazda motor. This is a good car for you to practice on when you get a neon. Dude. What does that Wait, mean? Because he's always oh, wanted want a neon. A neon. When, he, when he gets a what? neon. I want a neon RT. When what? He, yes. yes. You didn't know that? No, that, that, that's, that's like his dream car. That's my white whale. That in the uh, <laughs> 2000 Chevy Monte Carlo SS. Yes. <laughs> For obvious reasons. What is wrong with you? <laughs> he's uh, Dale. <laughs> <laughs> I got weird quirks. I like things, he all right? He looks like Dale Earnhardt. <laughs> so, yeah, no. So, it'll help. Yeah. Plus, the shifter in this is actually a lot of fun. It's kind of, it's really notchy. I think you're going to like it when you drive. It looks like it's in the right placement for when you're on the wheel and it's like, it's like right there when you grab yeah. it. Yeah, it's yeah. short too. I mean, it's pretty short for just an economy box. Yeah. I like this. You grab it right here and you push this button. Yep. Oh, it's so cool. So it's actually got a lot of space back there for a little car and you got that. Hatchback. Hatchback life. So. <laughs> 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 As he dives yeah, in there. I'm stuck. Yeah. Gonna need some help or you got it? I got muscles. There you go. Hold on. 
Yeah, one of the things I haven't fixed yet. There we go. All right. Uh, so as you, it's a good size trunk. It even has a spare tire. Yeah, and you can drop the seat to actually get a lot of room. Yeah, I fit my golf clubs in there, no oh, problem. I knew. <laughs> That's all you care about is the goddamn golf clubs. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm able to Mind actually it. haul a lot and it does pretty good yeah so have you done uber yet in this no oh. I don't think I will you could do uber I think they have hours now <laughs> <laughs> I'm not good with the whole people thing either so what is that stickers stickers, stickers. yes so I have my endangered species sticker just to let everyone know I'm a yep. manual. Just Manuals. in case they didn't notice me rolling back into them, I had the sticker. Yep. Manuals are going away. We gotta save them. We gotta save them. I have my Earnhardt sticker to let everyone know that I'm a Dale Earnhardt senior fan at heart. <laughs> but that adds a whopping 10 horsepower. I can yes. feel it. All and the bald eagles. Roadkill adds like plus eight horsepower. No, that actually takes oh, away. Awesome. I think I put that on and the string in here that holds this up broke immediately. No. So <laughs> it's definitely got its roadkill quirks uh. to it, but. Other than that, yeah, it's stickers, lots of room in the back. And like I said, the most like outstanding thing for it was I got new wheels and tires for it. Yeah. What size everything? Um, it's 185.55 on a set of Enki J10s with 20 millimeter offset on them. I like how it's got drums. Yeah, it's light, light enough so it doesn't seem to affect it. I looked, they don't make any uh, disc conversions yet, so... Really? Well, I didn't find it. I got those, and it's actually improved the handling a lot. Before, I had just the stock alloy rooms that came with it, and it uh, definitely was not good through the corners. See, I mean, it would shatter, and I felt like I was going to die. You can touch the paint. I did a lot of detail on that. I'd probably rub your hand right off of it. Oh, I know you very well. Yes. That, that feels like an Ethan Clay yeah. right that, there. Bring your Damn. cars by. I can do oh, it. That is like prime. Wow. It's, yeah, that's a clay bar and two coats of wax. So I take care of the cars. I try to at least. So now I actually have paint that's nice. That's the rewarding quality. I don't have to go outside and go, fuck, that looks ugly. <laughs> <laughs> so you're gonna, I'm sorry if you're going to get demonetized for the F-bomb there. You, we say fuck all the time. Okay, good. <laughs> I wasn't sure if we're doing this for ads or just for the hell of it. Hell of it. <laughs> all right, good. Oh, good. Oh, um, so what do you plan on doing to it next? You got some mods for it coming up? Yeah, so I have my eye on some on a racing beat exhaust. Ooh. So that'll make it probably sound a little bit more sportier. And then uh, next is probably going to be a set of Coney shocks on all four corners and then racing beat uh, lowering springs. Not too aggressive. They're like, I think, just a few millimeters they're not too bad okay. still want to be able to get it in driveways and stuff <laughs> why look how small it is i love how small look it is look at the back doors yes the back door look there's not there's <laughs> like two feet of car one behind of, the back door one of the things i like about the mazda 2 is from certain angles it looks like it's a two-door right no yeah i see it yeah, yeah. it does i saw it but I, I kind of wish it was a two door, but yeah. then at the same time, I'm like, for the longest it's time, not that bad. Yeah, for the longest time, when when the thing came out, I thought they had like a two door version because it, it so looks too. like the, it, it, like from certain angles, it looks like a two door. I mean, I just want to see a picture of this car cocking a leg. Yes, it's <laughs> so cool. But well, when he gets when he, when he gets his springs, we're gonna see it. It's a torsion beam. It's all, it's solid. <laughs> Sick. Oh my god, everything has more bolstering than all my cars! Well, there's no okay, asphalt so, bolstering, yeah, no butt bolstering, but the side bolstering is really good. Oh, that's a good shifter spot right there. Yeah, it's good. Oh, ooh, 59,000 miles. It's short, too. Pretty that's short for what Oh, that's is. sick! So you get your, you can swap. You gotta your say what it is. Why? That, it's the, it's the, um, vent it's a control. manual vent uh, ventilation oh, thing. You wanna hold this? <laughs> Yeah, so we got the manual vent as he breaks yeah, like, it. New, new, new cars are always like like electric now. This is it's manual. Yeah, you get to listen to the thud and wonder if you just broke your broke it's something. Not. It's that's that's it's it fine. moving. It's moving the flaps on the inside. I know. I'm messing with him. <laughs> I like how the thing is a little circle. That's cool. Yeah, it's very simple. Yeah, I know. That's why I like it. The tiny little RPM gauge. <laughs> yeah, this is so cool. Well, me and Zach were talking about. We're like, yeah, I don't have any um, temp gauges. I don't have any fluid gauges. Yeah, I don't have no, anything. No gauges. It's Nothing. Got, <laughs> it's got if your engine's cold light and then if your engine's warm light. Yep. Light. That's Where's it. Actually, give me the camera. Turn where's the, the, where's turn the, the gas gauge? Huh? Turn the ignition. It's on. in here. What? Not yeah, you don't have to turn it on. Oh, yeah. oh, there it is. It's digital. Yeah. Outside temperature forty-eight. What is this? We, we, ha we will get demonetized. <laughs> yeah. we get I think that was enough not to get copyrighted. You <laughs> yeah. should be alright. So. If anyone can name it though... I don't even know comment. what it is. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, yeah. Okay. Cool horn! <laughs>
And you got um, all this glove box storage too. That's for a, all that's my a, Beatles feet. That's a big ass glove box there. <laughs> I've got you covered on Abbey Road, Sergeant Peppers, and, and you got an Rubber ox. Soul. You got an ox cord. Yep, that's sick. So I've actually got like you have creature, three cup holders. Yeah, I got creature comfort, comforts wow. going on here. That's amazing. It's a lap of luxury in here. This is. This is made for Matt Wilson and stuff. Uh, this is like the uh, the Mercedes of Japanese cars. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cool. Ford style vents. Yeah, that might be the only thing that's Ford in here. And I doubt <laughs> it. There's probably other pieces of it. Well, I think that's it. Yeah, that's probably about it. I mean, there's not a lot of car to cover. It's kind of small. <laughs> <laughs> you ready, Zach? Yeah. All right. Come on, let's go drive it. Get in! Let's go use and abuse it. <laughs> Please not. <laughs> hello. It just oh, says hello. It did say hello. <laughs> yeah. All right, driving Ethan's Mazda 2. Oh. Easy clutch. I think we should go that way, but that way at first yeah. because cars. It's very quiet. It's very quiet. So quiet. Oh, hello. Woo! <laughs> I can't see. Yep. Oh, this is good. Right off the bat, this is good. Oh, the steering. What is up with that steering? I don't know. Whoa. Whoa. It's like... Power. Oh, my God. I think I needed second, then. Yeah, I need second. Second's long, then. I don't know. Let me, let me feel For out the short. Sure. Let me feel out the... Situation. Yeah. yeah. Let's go to second. Oh, you have, you have to like... Oh my god, it's perfect! You have to stab the gas a bit. Oh, to get... Uh, to get it to rev. To rev match? Yeah. It might need a go pedal. Oh, that'd be good. Yeah. Like a... Like a reprogram like, anything. Yeah. yeah. I, think, uh, I think Ethan said this is fly-by-wire. Um, so, this is, this is bizarre. The steering... What does it feel like? I think it's electric. It feels like it's electric. It's probably it's, electric. Wow. Most cars are electric. Yeah. It just what? feels so good. It does feel good. It's I really like this. Well, when we were driving up with Ethan, yeah. it felt good, but he had no confidence in it. Yeah, so it kind of felt a little sketchy. You feel like you have confidence, and it feels like the car is just planted. Yeah, it feels planted. And we're going pretty quick. Like, this is... The brakes... Brakes are a little spongy, but I think they're there. Okay. They're there. Um, I'm, not, I'm not too confident with it yet. It's, you feel, it feels like you're taking yeah. the right line and not questioning yourself, I should think. Yeah. Or, I mean, I should say. It's, I don't know, there's something about it. It's, I mean, it definitely feels planted. Yeah. And I know I'm not putting nearly as much as I could into it. Yeah. I don't know. It's, I like it, feels, how, it feels a little, it feels just a little numb right now. Um, little I little think, numb. I think it just needs to be a little stiffer. I can feel it rolling a little bit. Quite a bit. Yeah, it needs... I like how we're reviewing this like it's a performance car. It, this is this is an economy car. Yeah. That's just coincidentally good at performance because it's so light. Yeah. I didn't get I didn't get a curb weight. If we got it we gotta open the door and look at the gross vehicle it weight. It definitely feels really light. Yeah, no. This is good. Does it feel would you say as a hot car reviewer word, tossable? It's tossable. Let's see what we got. Full lock. Oh my god. Yeah, good turning radius. This is great. All right. Oh, yeah, it oh, goes. Oh, yeah. Oh my god, the shifter's so good. This this feels right at home. Because, like, you go from the steering wheel to the shifter, it's, like, right there. Right where you think it's going to be. This is good. Oh my god. I've always wanted to drive a Mazda 2. You know what, why? Huh. This would probably be a... A hundred horsepower feels good! This would probably be a good canyon car. <laughs> probably! <laughs> I think it is. Yeah. This is really good. I think you could definitely surprise some people. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Because it's a Mazda 2. So. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, I, I've never seen any modified ones. Yeah, no. Zero but, expectations. Yeah, I think just look. Maybe just some lowering springs or like, I don't know, just some simple no, coilovers. I don't know. Okay, so... How, how, sway bars for sure, I think. Yeah, sway bars for sure. But how I've felt so far in the car, yeah. I don't feel like it's over, or uh, I feel like it's over sprung already. Like so it's like it's I, too bouncy. Yeah, yeah. The the rebound on the on the shocks, I feel like, is a little wrong. 
So I, I feel like if you got a whole just like aftermarket shock yeah. and spring setup, it would just make a world of difference. Mm -hmm. Like coilovers obviously are the better version of that, but if you want coilovers to be good and not blow up every five, 10 seconds, yeah. then you'd be spending a lot of money on this little thing. So the, st the, uh, the steering, it kind, of, it kind of wakes up a little bit once you go faster actually. Okay. It's, it was. It felt a little slow when we were kind of going slow. Now we're stuck behind a Kia Soul. Yes. We're not going anywhere now. It goes. It goes good. I think. I'm sorry, Tyler. It might go better than your car. It definitely goes better. It than definitely has a better third gear. Yeah. No. Oh yeah, yeah. We're going to third. Yeah. The gears are not far apart. We're going. We're doing. We're doing good. This is great. Okay, if we try fourth gear, five thousand RPM. Beautiful. Oh my god, look at wow. this. Those gears are nice and short. I wonder wow. how fifth is. Fifth is probably just a way overdrive. Right? I want to autocross this. Yeah, I know. That would be <laughs> so fun. Really hucking this into a corner. Yeah. I'm actually getting used to it already. This is good. I'm already getting used to this. I love it. What a good little economy car. This is really great. Oh my god, you could, you could murder some Civics with this. Driver switch? Yeah, let's do driver switch. Okay, so one thing is, for me, what is naturally the brake is my foot on both the brake and the clutch at the same time. The, the what, center what? of the wheel... Are you left foot braking already? Yeah. <laughs> the, the center of the wheel yeah. is usually where my brake is, but yeah. the center of the wheel here is like both at the same time. Huh. Yeah, so I'm a little over this way, and people kind of make a big thing about that on YouTube videos. Yeah. I'm totally fine with it. <laughs> I'm cool with it. The the throw of the clutch, not the bite, the whole throw of the clutch is pretty short. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> right? This is good. Ethan, you got a good car. This is, ooh, yeah, that steering is weird. It's shaking. Why is it shaking? I don't know. Is it like, is it starting to understeer? No, that was no understeer at all. Huh. Um, it could be like a wheel bearing or huh. maybe a shock that's a little tired. Yeah. I was thinking about going into second. And I just oh, I, I saw it going behind you guys when you went across the, the second bridge, like over that really bumpy bit. Yeah. The front right wheel was like hopping around a lot. Okay, so that, that strut is blown. Okay, that's okay. what I was thinking. That's exactly what I felt. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah, no. Okay, so one of the struts is blown. Yeah. That's fine. You can still drive with that. It's yeah. Not, it's not a dense death sentence. Your springs you aren't blown. Third, it's got a good amount of torque. I'm at yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's a little, little hippity hoppy. That's all right, because Ethan has new suspension on the way anyways. Oh, it loves to get winded out. <laughs> oh, this is sick. I'm going to go to fifth. Oh. What? Fifth is also very close to all the other gears. 3,000 RPM, same gearing as the Porsche. All right, we're having a few little te technical difficulties with the camera. It likes to keep turning off. I think it's the freaking G-force of this little car. I can't believe this. There's still some snow. Oh, I love winding it out. <laughs> There's still snow after like two weeks after it rained up here. Yeah. This is great. Well, it's like 20 at night here. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> oh my God, it's sharp. It doesn't feel sharp, but it is sharp. <laughs> Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know exactly what you mean. Like, I think about where to put it and my hands go, ooh, this isn't right. Exactly. It just does it. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, okay, cool. Oh, I didn't even think of this thing. Probably, you can probably get a really induction. Oh, so. I bet you can get a really good induction -y sounding intake for this. Oh my god, this car. Wow. I'm so surprised. Yeah. At this. I would probably start off with like a louder intake just to see what that sounds like first and then do an exhaust. The, it, it rotated a little bit there. Really? I think so. I didn't feel it. It felt like it just went in the line. It was just perfect. This is great. Brakes are good. good brakes. Finally out of the sun, but we have super force in front of us. I love this car. If I anyone, love. if anyone knows Mazda right. twos, yeah. I think I like this better than the Abarth. No, you feels, no way. It feels more stable. Really? Yeah. You got to drive it on this this road right here. Oh, okay, I'll get it's, a shot. It's perfect. It's got the perfect amount of power, which is weird for a hundred horsepower. Right? It right. might have more than a hundred. Maybe I don't. No. It feels really good. It's probably just so goddamn light, it, you know? Yeah. It is lighter than the Abarth. You think so? Yeah. Wow. What do you mean you think so? Abarth's way heavier. 
It's a tiny little car, though. I mean, this is like a tin can. This, it, I mean, everything kind of looked more basic than the Fiat. This is like a modern... Like, this could probably be like a modern-day EK hatch. <laughs> I'm going to go around this bit, and then I'm going to turn around, and you're going to drive up this road. Okay. It's just... Where that white car's parked with the, the turning radius? Yeah. You're so connected. I know what it's doing. I know exactly what's happening with the car. I know how much gas I can put into it. This is the perfect learner's car. Yeah. If you want to learn how to drive fast, I usually recommend Mazda 2s and shit, but this car is really engaging. <laughs> this is good. Yeah. If anyone knows Mazda 2s really well and they have like a disc brake conversion, let us know. Yes. Because, uh, <laughs> with that. Yeah, we gotta get some... some videos on this car and fix yeah. it up. Yeah, we gotta get some rear disc on this. And for now they're good. Probably just it could probably what? just use better pads in the front. This car is amazing. <laughs> that was, that felt really good there. That this was good. This is amazing. That felt good. Every corner I go around, it gets better and better oh, and better. I know. You have no idea. This right? Is crazy. That's what I was saying. Like 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 it feels kind of numb at first, and then you start driving it more and more. Grinding it out. You're like oh, oh wow. You're already used to it. Dude, this is this is a Mazda too. <laughs> <laughs> we were in a WRX. Bored. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry. All I want to do is drive this car. Yes. That's all I want to do. Oh. I just want to drive this more and more and more until the brakes boil, <laughs> the tires are gone, uh. and the suspension's shot. This is an amazing car. This is really good. All right, so driver switch, we'll be right back. All right. I'm Easy. having Wyatt go back because that was too good. I know, I, I have to go again. The it Zach, feels so nice. Zach just drove this bit and it felt really good in the passenger seat. I mean, it's just, it's stable and it, you're totally connected to the car. Yes. Oh, yeah. Right? Oh, yes. And then cut in this hard. Yes. yes. Do you feel this? Yes. Oh my God! It's bringing, it's bringing me back. It's flying, it's flying, it's bringing me back. Oh my God! Oh. This wow. is amazing. Yes. Oh. This is so weird. It's this an is, economy it's car. It's not even a Honda. <laughs> <laughs> get it, get it, yeah. yeah. That's, I'm gonna try third all the yeah, way. I think third. Just get on the power early. Right. Yeah, now, perfect. Oh, yeah. yeah. Go! <laughs> oh, he'll climb! Wow! Oh, yes! Oh, son. Flat. Flat. Yeah. That's flat. Yes! <laughs> oh my god, you can use all the power! Oh my oh, god! Oh, yes! Come on, Super, get out of the way! There's a Mazda 2 barely on your ass! I'm gonna go back. Okay. Yes! Wasn't Good. that amazing? Good car! I don't understand. Oh man! I haven't driven a car this good in does it so make, long. Does it does it make sense, any sense to anybody to sell a Corvette and get a Mazda two? I uh, to me and me that only. Make, that makes sense to me. That's it. I'm having so much fun in this car. Oh, come on, third gear. Come on, third. Let it dip down a little too much. All right, now we're back in the VTEC. Yeah. Mazda two kicked in, yo. Wow. Well, the, the steering wheel is good too. Yeah, it's got a good grip. Yeah, for you. I would get a little bit smaller. I'd go yeah. for like a 350 millimeter. It's a little smaller. Yep. Oh, oh yes. Right. Oh. It just goes into corners so perfect. Oh, yeah. oh it just it gets, It's got more. Oh my god, I'm getting more. Yeah. I'm getting more confidence in this. this oh is, wow. This is a really good car. <laughs> Woo. Oh, here we go. You know what? This is probably faster than the Porsche. <laughs> yeah, it's faster than the Porsche. This is god damn it! This is fast. This is faster than the Porsche. Of course no. it is. Why? It doesn't it's weigh anything. It's not supposed anything. to be. Uh, Mazdas are not supposed to be faster than Porsches, dude. We I'm gonna go to home. All what? I can think about, all I can think about, is driving this car. I'm gonna oh. go home tonight. <laughs> and I'm just gonna be thinking about driving this car. I know. Me too. This is so good. Oh I didn't. God. I didn't see it. I didn't dude. think it would be this good. We're I don't know. What? <laughs> They didn't design it to feel that no. good. No, it doesn't even have independent in the back. It's got a freaking solid beam, like yeah. a like a van or an Abarth. All right, let's go. <laughs> oh yes! This is one of the best. No, not best. Most engaging cars we've ever driven on the track. For the, this is amazing car for great for the value. Yeah. Not even just for the value, it's just an amazing car to feel. Yeah. Well, 
Thank you for watching. This is Zach and Wyatt. This is a Mazda 2, and it's one of the most fun cars Zach and Wyatt have ever driven. If you haven't, you need to get I you, don't get you, it. People need to drive a Mazda 2 to understand. Yeah. Take it in the crest, like, a, it doesn't matter if it's stock. I mean. Yeah, stock. It's so good. I mean, right. go to, go to car. He got it from Carmax. So I'm sure they. I'm sure they. <laughs> I'm sure they still have some new ones on the lot that are yeah. like relatively new. Go go test drive a Mazda two. Yep. Tell us what you think, because we love it. We and, really um, love it. Yeah, it's it's good. Go try one. Can you get out so I could drive again back to the spot? Okay. okay. <laughs> um. So. Uh, Thanks for watching. Thanks. Bye. 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 <laughs> Jeremy Clarkson did this with the Abarth, the Top Gear. Mm, mm, good car. <laughs> And that's how you feel yeah, now. That's how I really okay. feel about this car. Okay. <laughs>